hello friends in today's video i will show you how to crochet this beautiful granny table mat i have made it in two different contrasting colors i am using a 3.5 mm crochet hook for my project and this three ply yarn so first of all make a slip knot and then with the help of crochet hook start making chains for the project make chain 1 chain 2 chain 3 chain 4 and then make a slip stitch into the first chain to form a ring and now we would work into this ring make chain 1 chain 2 and then chain 3 these three chains will be counted as a double crochet stitch now make chain 1 and then chain 2 for the first corner of our granny square now wrap the yarn around the crochet hook go into this ring and then draw a loop we have three loops on our hook pull the yarn through two loops first and then pull the yarn through these remaining two loops this is our double crochet stitch now make double crochet 2 into the ring then make double crochet 3 and after these 3 double crochet stitches we would make other corner so make 2 chains again and then we would make 3 double crochet stitches into the ring double crochet 1 double crochet 2 double crochet 3 after the set of 3 double crochet stitches make another corner by making 2 chains and then make 3 double crochet stitches again then make 2 chains for the last corner of our granny square and then here 3 chains will be counted as a double crochet stitch now we would make 2 double crochet stitches into the ring double crochet 1 and then double crochet 2 and now make a slip stitch into the third chain 1 2 and then 3 so make a slip stitch into the third chain and now we would work into this chain 2 space first round is completed pull this starting yarn and cut it with the help of cutter because we have even these yarn, yarn end into our stitches now make 3 chains which will be counted as a double crochet stitch and then make a double crochet into the chain 2 space and then make a double crochet again into the chain 2 space now we have a set of 3 double crochet including 3 chains make 2 chains for the corner and then make double crochet 1 double crochet 2 and then double crochet 3 into this same chain 2 space now make chain 1 and go into the next chain 2 space of corner make double crochet 1 double crochet 2 double crochet 3 chain 2 for the second corner then double crochet 1 double crochet 2 and then double crochet 3 into the same chain 2 space make chain 1 
work into the next chain to space which is our third corner and in this we would make three double crochet stitches two chains and then three double crochet stitches as we have made in the previous corner now make chain 1 and here is our last chain to space of the fourth corner and we would again make three double crochet stitches two chains and then three double crochet stitches into this corner and now we will make chain 1 here and make a slip stitch into the third chain and the second round is completed for the third one we have to work into the chain 2 space of corner so first of all make a slip stitch into the double crochet stitch next then into the third double crochet stitch and then we would make a slip stitch into the chain 2 space because we have to work into this chain 2 space for the next round so make three chains here which will be counted as a double crochet stitch in every round and make two double crochet stitches into the chain 2 space then make two chains and make three double crochet stitches into this chain 2 space then make chain 1 and now we would work into this chain 1 space here so in this chain 1 space make double crochet 1 double crochet 2 and then double crochet 3 then we have chain 2 space next so make chain 1 and into this chain 2 space we would make three double crochet stitches then two chains and three double crochet stitches and we would just make three double crochet after making chain 1 into each of the chain 1 space and in every chain 2 space which is the corner stitch we would make three double crochet stitches two chains and then three double crochet stitches and with the same process we would just complete this round so now make chain 1 here and make a slip stitch into the third chain then make a slip stitch into the next double crochet stitch then into the next one and after that into the chain 2 space start the next round by making three chains and make two double and double crochet stitches into the chain 2 space then two chains and three double crochet stitches into the same chain 2 space then make chain 1 and make three double crochet stitches into this chain 1 space again make chain 1 and make three double crochet stitches into the next chain 2 space chain 1 space sorry and after that we have chain 2 space in which we would make corner stitch by making three double crochet two chain and three double crochet so just complete this round by following the same process 
एंड मेक सेवन रोज सो आई हैव मेड टोटल ऑफ सेवन रोज हियर विद दिस ग्रैनी स्क्वेयर डिजाइन नाउ जस्ट पुल दी यान कट इट विद द हेल्प ऑफ कटर एंड रिमूव द एक्स्ट्रा यान स्ट्रैंड now we would weave this yarn end with the help of this tapestry needle at the back side of our granny square patch make a knot with the help of needle like this our stitches would not get loose this way and then just pull the yarn needle through some back side stitches and cut the extra yarn strand now work in the chain one space after corner stitch you can start from anywhere now i am using this blue color yarn so make a slip knit slip knot first and then join this yarn in the chain one space after our corner of granny square then just join this yarn and pull it make three chains and just make two double crochet stitches into this chain one space then make chain one go into the next chain one space and make three double crochet stitches into it make chain 1 into the next chain 1 space make three double crochet stitches again make chain 1 and make three double crochet stitches into the next chain 1 space so we would just make three double crochet stitches in each of the chain 1 space till our corner of granny square plus chain 1 and in the corner stitch we would just make three double crochet stitches two chains and three double crochet stitches as we have made in our granny square patch also so now just make chain 1 and here is our chain 2 space in which we would make three double crochet stitches 1 2 3 then make chain 2 and make three double crochet stitches into the same chain 2 space also so now just make three double crochet plus chain 1 on the side also till the chain 1 space before our next corner now turn the work and make a slip stitch into the first double crochet stitch then into the next one and then into the third double crochet stitch make a slip stitch and we have to work into the chain one space so make a slip stitch into the chain one space also now make three chains and make two double crochet stitches total of 3 including 3 chains then make chain 1 work up into the next chain 1 space here and make 3 double crochet stitches into it now just make 3 double crochet plus chain 1 till this side 
एंड एट कॉर्नर मेक टू डबल क्रूशे थ्री डबल क्रूशे टू चेन एंड थ्री डबल क्रूशे स्टिचेस एंड देन वर्क अप टू दी नेक्स्ट साइड ऑल्सो सो आई हैव जस्ट कंप्लीटेड दिस राउंड नाउ टर्न दी वर्क अगेन एंड मेक आ स्लिप स्टिच इन टू दी फर्स्ट डबल क्रूशे स्टिच देन इन टू दी सेकेंड वन then into the third double crochet stitch and after that make a slip stitch into the chain one space also then make three chains and again start making double crochets in every chain one space here we would make two then make chain one and make double crochet three times into the next chain one space and just complete working in every chain one space and corner chain two space also so i have just completed this round also now make a slip stitch into the first double crochet stitch then into the second one then into the third one and after that we would just change the color and now we would use this gray color yarn so just make a slip uh, slip knot first and join this yarn here with the slip stitch pull the blue color yarn also here and make three chains now make two double crochet stitches into this chain one space one and then two make chain one and go into the next chain one space and make three double crochet stitches into this chain one space make chain one again go into the next chain one space and make three double crochet stitches <coughs> so just complete three rounds with this color and cut this blue color yarn now we would make three rounds with this gray color and then three more rounds with this blue color again so i have just completed three rounds with gray color and three rounds with blue color now we would do exactly the same for the opposite side also i have completed other side also and we won the yarn ends you can also make it in bigger size if you want so give this video a big thumbs up if you like and don't forget to subscribe to get more tutorial videos like this thank you so much for watching bye